In my world, feeling the love and admiration that my loved ones give to me makes me feel the most beautiful. I am a goddess and so are you. So today, I'm here to show you how to let your inner goddess reveal herself through your outer beauty. Enjoy. So I've already moisturized and now I'm going to prime my skin using my Too Faced Hangover RX. So for a little bit of glow under my foundation, I'm going to add the Charlotte Tilbury Wonder Glow. I'm going to go ahead and color correct and neutralize using my Tarte CC Under Eye Concealer under the eyes and on top of the lids. For foundation, I'm going to be using the IT Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC Plus Cream with SPF 50 and I'm in the shade Medium. I'm going to go ahead and take my IT Cosmetics CC Plus Eye Cream and this is a corrector and a concealer and the shade is in medium but I'm going to be placing this on the high points of my cheeks because it is a little too dark for underneath my eyes. This product has a wonderful shimmer to it and I feel it would add to the glow that I'm looking for. Now I'm going to take my Tarte Tartlet Amazonian Clay Matte Palette and I'm going to be using the shade Free Spirit all over the lid to set that concealer. Now I'm going to go ahead and take my Inglot Gel Liner in the shade 94 and I'm going to place that all over the lid as a base. I'm going to take my Inglot Eyeshadow Pigment and place that on top of the lid where I place the gel liner at. I'm going to go back in with my Tarte palette and use the shade Multitasker and I'm just going to take that on the crease and on the outer V. Now I'm going to go in with Natural Beauty and take that on the crease to help blend out that dark color. Now for the brows, I'm going to go ahead and take my Anastasia of Beverly Hills Brow Wiz in Ebony and my Benefit Gimme Brow in Deep. So for under my eyes, I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Age Rewind in the shade Light and the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 15 to help conceal and highlight that area a little bit. Now I'm going to go ahead and set my under eye concealer and the rest of my face using the IT Cosmetics All Over Face Brush and the Maybelline Dream Wonder Powder. I'm going to go back in with the shade Multitasker and a small brush and place that under my lash line. I'm going to go back in with the Inglot 94 Gel Liner and I'm going to take a small detail brush and place some of that product on the first third of the lash line. I'm going to go back in with the Inglot Eyeshadow Pigment in the shade 51 and place that over top the gel liner. I'm going to take the shade Super Mom and place that underneath my brow. For a little more glow, I'm going to go ahead and take my IT Cosmetics Airbrush Illuminator and All Over Face Powder and place that on the high points of my face. I'm going to go ahead and sculpt the face using the Filmstar Bronze and Glow. I'm going to go ahead and take my Wet n Wild Color Icon Sunset Junction and add a little bit more highlight and I'm going to be using these two shades right here. 
I'm gonna go ahead and take a blush from the MAC Wash and Dry collection called Crisp Whites and place that on the cheeks. I'm going to go ahead and tight line my eyes using the Frankie Rose Cosmetics eyeliner in Bombshell. Now for mascara, I'm going to be using the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara along with the L'Oreal Voluminous Miss Manga Mascara. Now for the lips, I'm going to go ahead and line my entire lip with MAC World Lip Liner. Now I'm going to take my IT Cosmetics Blurred Lines Lipstick in the shade Love. I'm going to take the MAC Allurin Aquatics Limited Edition Lip Gloss in Water Deities and placing that over top. Okay my love, so this is the completed look. I think this is absolutely perfect for when you want to let that inner goddess come out. I hope you guys like this video. Please thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.